I like this, this hours of the day where the light's very mellow. The beginning of the day when everything wakes up, when the birds are in the trees, when, when there's fog coming on. It's just uh, these very precious moments where the car comes out best. Uh, the, the human being is full of sensors and these sensors uh, have to be satisfied by information the car feeds in. A sports car has to, has to offer an emotional driving experience. You have to uh, feel exactly what the car is doing, so it has to be transparent in use. A GT3 is uh, for me in the first place the enthusiast's car. It's not so much about the pure raw speed. Uh, it has this, um, this, 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 yeah, this puristic, rewarding, emotional driving experience uh, that feeds your senses. It's a feast for the senses, this car, still. Uh, and this is what a, what a GT3 is all about. Yeah. My name is Andreas Bräuninger and I'm responsible for the GT Streetcar project within Porsche Motorsport as the overall project leader. I'm with our founder, Mr. Porsche, who once said um, the last car will be a sports car on Earth, and I think that's true. We created this niche with the 996 GT3, and it was a success story ever since. Yeah, I think the team spirit is very special in Porsche Motorsport. We know each other for such a long time, and we're all team players on the on, on one hand, but everybody's got his own ideas, and he wants to push it through for the car. Our target is always to have all systems in sync. It's the gearbox and the engine as a as a as a system. It was a spring last year yeah, when we had the first engines that really revved to 9000 and the first program of the gearbox that was close to what it is now. And um, I took the car out and I cancelled all my appointments and uh, made, made room for two hours of a drive in the Black Forest. That was the turning point for me to say, okay, um, because in that time we didn't know exactly if we used the PDK or if we use a manual. But um, from that point on I, see, I saw, okay, we can make the best double clutch transmission in the world. Finally, I was out for all the day. Uh, I spent four hours in the car and it, I came home and, and, and was very satisfied and happy and said, okay, we are going in the right direction. The challenge for us is to incorporate the systems, make the car the fastest, but still make it a very, very emotional experience 